Do you read me? Come in, please. Hi, I'm Merritt, W6NQ from RF Parts Diamond Antenna. I'm president of the company. We have been in business for over 40 years. And uh, we brought Diamond in in 1989. The premier antenna from, from uh, Japan. It, it is the top of the line mobile and base antenna for VHF and UHF and a few special antennas for HF multiband. We have some new introdu introductions this year in the diamond antenna line and I will have Wayne, the manager of the antenna side of the house, discuss that with you. Uh, I am primarily here to watch over the RF parts interests which we bring just a sample of some of the high power tubes or transistors that customers want. Okay, uh, it's Wayne Diamond Antenna. What we got here, new antennas, are the mono band HF. We have the uh, HF, uh, it's a HF6CL. It's a half wave, uh, six meter antenna. Right here's the 10 meter, this quarter wave. And we got the 20, 40, and 80. Doing pretty good. Grounding SO239 connectors. The mounting would probably be on our K400. They're a little big to be putting on uh, mag mount to try mag. And you have uh, end up getting problems with putting them on a mag mount. So the, the best mount would probably be our K400 series to mount because they are pretty tall. The half wave, I haven't tried it on too many mounts right now, but on a mag mount it will work because it's a half wave antenna. It gives you about 3 dB of gain on it. Uh, everything else is a quarter wave. The uh, other new antenna, oh and then here, each antenna actually has a nut. So what you're doing is you can fold it over. Not spring loaded, actually locks it in. So now when you put it back on, you tighten the nut, it's not folding over on you. The other new antenna we have is our uh, screwdriver antenna. It's an SD330. This comes with a UHF connector or has a 3H24 connector. Um, if you decide later on, you get the antenna and you decide, you know, change my mounts, I want a UHF connector, you give us a call. All it is is a plug, it's not an adapter. So you have three holes, three screws. You take those three screws out, pull your UHF connector, push in your 3H24, you just change the mounting on your, uh, on your antenna. It comes with the small whip. So this whip 
is uh, 6 through 40. This, the larger whip's uh, uh, 80 through 10. So if you're not going to work on 6 too much, you use the bigger whip. It's more efficient. It's a longer antenna. It will work with a tuner with the uh, better RF and turbo tuner. It's got to be modified or it's got to be ordered that way. If you, we have about a two year warranty on it. Anything happens, hit a tree, anything breaks, it's either repaired or fixed for you at no charge. Inside, if you don't have a tuner, you want to do it by yourself, you can do that and if down the line two, three years, you get a tuner, you send it into us, we'll actually remake it for you for a tuner at no charge. You pay the freight to us, we pay the freight back to you. So this is the one we've had for a while. It's our HV7A. Still has the locking fold over, but it's a, uh, it, it gives you two meter 440. This is your six meter coil here and 10 meter. Then you can have extra coils. You can go your uh, 40, 20, 17, or 15. So the antenna itself is two meter 440 and six. After uh, you can have two HFs after that. So that's been that one's been a, a pretty good antenna for us. The new adapter we have now a UHF. is our UHF. What we have, it comes with. It's a UHF to 3H24. Actually comes with a little tube of Loctite, your uh, female nut, and the screw. So here, what you have, it's the UHF connector. It's uh, nickel plated brass. You have the uh, male stud for the 3H24. So if you have a, um, a Tar Heel antenna, you have a, a, you know something that actually has the stud that you can take out, you don't have to use these two parts. It'll make it look just like ours, but with the UHF connector. If you have a ham stick, fire stick, something that has the stud built into the antenna, you can put the washer on, you have Loctite, put a little dab on there. Now you can actually screw on, lock it into place. Now you have a 3H24 heavy duty adapter. They're retailing about $19.95. Sometimes you can get them cheaper, but it is a UHF connector to 3H24.